Hey there everyone, Fezboy here. Welcome back to a new video. So to celebrate Shark Week, which starts this Sunday, which I believe should be the day this video gets posted, I'm kicking off a week-long, seven-day-long Shark Week video extravaganza. So this video is going to be my personal ranking of my top five favorite LEGO Sharks. So let's get into it. So let's start with number five. So here we have my fifth favorite Lego shark. This is the classic white shark. Um, if I had the new white shark, it'd take this spot. Or if I had the great white mold from the ocean exploration boat, or the skeleton shark from the Pirates of the Caribbean Deadman Tail No Tails boat, it'd replace this, but I don't. So I'm going with the sharks that I own. So all the classic sharks use the same body, which is a bit more blocky, less round, and doesn't have any detailed molds. And then it has this, the jaw piece, which all the normal sharks used, except for the saw shark, which had its specialized mold. And this, the snout points up, and it has the molded eye in it. And the mouth can also open up and fit, usually you can fit like a fish piece or something. I have the stick piece, you can slide it in, close the mouth, and it, uh, yeah, fits perfectly fine. So let's move on to number four. So here's my fourth favorite Lego shark. This is the basic regular newer version of the shark so uh, to start off the body it's more streamlined more smooth and rounded and has a molded gills in i wish they could have added in the five gills which most normal sharks have but i understand getting five would have made it look wonky and three looks all right and then the mouth it's less pointed at the end and it's not uh, as pointed towards the top it's more slanted towards the snout and um, then the eye instead of it being a molded in part it's actually just the minifigurized eye instead of a molded part, which I think works really well for a Lego shark. Uh, same function, the mouth can open, close, and all that. And uh, yeah, let's move on to number three. Here we have my third favorite Lego shark, which is the newer version of the saw shark. So the older saw, sh saw shark is pretty cool, but I prefer this one just because it looks better in my opinion. So it's got the same body as all the basic sharks do for the new Lego City shark piece. And then it's got a new head, which is pretty much the uh, new head, but it's got the uh, saw shark uh, snout on it, which I think makes it look really cool. And uh, yeah, its mouth can also open and close. It's got the gills, and there's nothing really else special about it. But I still think it trumps the basic shark just because it looks cooler. So let's move on to number two. So here we have my second favorite Lego shark, which is from the Creator 3-in-1 Ocean Animal set from a few years ago. I can't remember the exact year, set name, or set number. But I loved it, picked it up as soon as I could. I've only really kept the shark together. I built the other ones just to test how they looked, but I really love the shark. I don't have any other side builds, just the shark, because shark build is just so awesome. So it's got articulating uh, movement, so you can move it in two different spots, the head and then the tail area. It's got its tail fin, these two back fins, these uh, the two fins here, and then its dorsal fin. Its mouth also can open and close. It also has the gills here, which has the one, two, three. So it's more like just a larger version of the normal shark. And I really love how they were able to get the nice uh, dual color of like the darker top and then the lighter bottom of a shark. I also really like how they did the eyes with the, uh, I believe it's a translucent green uh, pole that stuck through some Technic pieces. And uh, yeah, I really enjoy it. really love the set and thought it was a great set. So let's move on to number one. So here we have my number one favorite Lego shark, which is the brand new as of... 2020 Lego Hammerhead. I'm not sure if they're ever going to have this in another set again. I hope they do because it's such a really cool piece. But like, so when I first looked at the new images, I was just blown away. So excited because Hammerheads are my personal favorite shark, which is, this is why it's at number one. Um, it uses the same body, but in a sand blue, which looks really cool. And then the head is the Hammerhead head, which I really love how they got the eyes on the side. And I believe, like, if you look at this scientifically, biologically, this would be the head of a scalloped Hammerhead, if I'm not mistaken. Not 100% sure. But, uh, yeah, really love the mold. I think it brings a really cool design to the sharks. And I love that they added a new shark design that wasn't just a different color or a saw shark. And, yeah, the mouth can also open and close. 
And that's about it. Here's what it looks like from the front, which also looks pretty cool. Kind of menacing, because you can't see the eyes, really. And, uh, yeah. Let's move on to my final thoughts. So, yeah. That was my ranking of my top five favorite Lego sharks. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, consider liking and subscribing. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so you can stay up to date with my Shark Week video extravaganza. Have a good day, and Alonzi!